Hey what's up guys welcome back this is Ashok from TechEV and today I am back with a new ROM review for OnePlus 5 and the name of the ROM is AOSP Extended. As you can see these are the software information Android version 8.1, Extended version 5.5 which is an official version, Android security patch level is 5th May 2018 and this ROM is also supported by many other devices I'll put up the link in the description below you can check it out whether this ROM supports your device or not and the best part of this ROM is it comes with an OTA update so if any OTA update available you can go to system settings and check for the update this will be the first look of your ROM sliding towards your right hand side will give you Google feed and long pressing home screen going to home setting it comes with pixel launcher which is a modded pixel launcher which gives you customizations related to home screen, app drawer, app icon and miscellaneous. It also includes Google camera and as you guys are aware you get best portrait pictures in Google camera. On this ROM I have been using expose module which is Android P expose module to give a new look to quick setting panel and setting menu. And things like volt services fingerprint scanner, double tap to wake, everything is working fine and a most stable ROM I have ever used. If you want to customize this ROM, you can find in settings inside the setting panel which is called as extensions. So here you have lots of customization options and this ROM also have always on display which can be found under ambient display. In setting panel you get additional settings like ambient display which is for oneplus devices, notification slider again for oneplus device and few oneplus screen off gestures. Under ambient display you can turn it on then you have few options like pulse notification, proximity sensor which includes hand wave and pocket pulse notification. Then under notification you can swap the buttons and you can also customize the notification slider. You also have few screen off gestures which can be enabled from here and then you can customize it. This ROM also comes with a root management but make sure to flash magisk after installing this ROM. Now going to extensions, here you can see all the customizations related to status bar, notification panel, navigation, recents, lock screen and system. Under status bar you have all the items related to status bar which includes clock and date. Status bar battery style, battery bar which I have already enabled on the status bar, traffic indicator, career label and miscellaneous extensions. Under notification panels you have two options of quick settings and notifications. Navigation if you want to enable on screen buttons then you can go here and enable the navigation button. You also have few customizations related to the navigation button. Under Recents, you have Recents UI and in which you can also use Alternative Recents which is known as Slim Recents. Lock screen gives you a few customizations related to lock screen in which you have pocket detection, double tap to sleep on the lock screen, clock widget, alarm text, lock screen charging info, media art and lock screen visualizer. And the last one over here in extension is system which includes general tweaks, animation, this also have android p animation style, weather, button, app operations where you can control the activities of the applications and at last you have system app remover under which you can uninstall any applications which is related to system and remove it from your device. Now talking about the benchmark results, with Geekbench application. Single core scores 1983 wherein multi core scores 6127. Going with Antutu bench application and under this results are 1,84,365. Now talking about the battery life which I got it on the second cycle. First cycle was not that great but after doing a second cycle and the battery life was really amazing. And this was the battery life which I got it on the second cycle that is 4 hours and 45 minutes with 8% of battery was still remaining. So guys these were the things available on this ROM and if you have any kind of questions do let me know in the comment section below. 
as of now only this much in this video hope you like the video and if you like the video then do give me a thumbs up also if you are new to my channel then do not forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching have a great day